Okay, so what I need right now to make this connection is I'm going to set this in the software to be a line input. And you'll see it's a two-wire line input, a two-pin. It's a mono input at line level. Okay, so what are you going to do? Well, everyone's familiar here with these RCA cables, left and right, right? Uh, yellow, or sorry, white and uh, red. So what I did over here is I took the white side, and what I did is I chopped it off, okay? And when you chop it off on one side, so I got just RCA on one side, and then over here, what you see is you get a bunch of wires. And once you peel back that little jacket, you see there'll be like a cable on the inside with some wires. That's your positive. You see on this thing over here how there's like a positive and then that little terminal looking? Well, that's the negative, okay? And, on, and once you strip this away, these wires here on the outside, these are your negatives. And the wires on the inside of that extra little jacket there that you need to strip back, those are positive, okay? So in this case right here, here's the little connector that I'm going to use. It comes with this box, okay? And it's going to go right in here on these two terminals, all right? And when I put the wires in there and I screw them in, I'm going to put the ones on the inside of that jacket, on that extra little white cable there. I'm going to put those on the positive side. And all the other wires there on the outside, well, on the outside of this connection here, those are going to go on the minus or the terminal side of a mono connection. So that's how you turn an RCA stereo cable into an RCA mono by chopping off one side and then those are the connections you make inside.